I stopped trying to define punk around the same time I stopped trying to define Islam. They aren't so far removed as you'd think. Both began in tremendous bursts of truth and vitality, but seem to have lost something along the way. The energy, perhaps, that comes with knowing the world has never seen such positive force and fury, and never would again. Both have suffered from sellouts and hypocrites, but also from true believers whose devotion had crippled their creative drive. Both are viewed by outsiders as unified, cohesive communities when nothing can be further from the truth. I could go on, but the most important similarity is that like punk, as mentioned above, Islam is itself a flag, an open symbol representing not things, but ideas. You cannot hold punk or Islam in your hands. So what could they mean besides what you want them to?